Good morning everybody, I'm Jeremy Horn and this is the first in a series of videos I'm going to be doing. Uh, I wasn't really sure about content for the video, so I figured I'd start with a funny story. Uh, since everyone's always asking me for stories about the uh, dark days or the good old days of MMA. Uh, this story goes back to probably early 99. Uh, I was fighting in a rodeo arena um, on a dirt floor in a boxing ring. So I take the guy down, I mount him, I'm, I'm punching him, he turns, gives me his back. Uh, so as I'm trying to choke him, he gets up on all fours and crawls out of the ring. Uh, that kind of pissed me off, so when I got the choke in, I didn't let go. Uh, we were hanging halfway out of the cage. There were actually people holding us up uh, from falling on the floor, but I didn't care. I wasn't going to let go. Uh, so he taps, um, and I was pissed. I got up and threw my mouthpiece into the crowd. Then the referee told me he planned on restarting us because he didn't count the tap because we were outside of the ring, which is probably reasonable. So I had to get the attention of one of the kids in the front row and have him go find my mouthpiece for me. So he brings it back, and I had to wash all the dirt and crud off of it and put it back in for the restart. Uh, the referee restarts us, you know, gives me the choke again. I, I choke him out again right away. Um, but uh, the moral of the story is, if you're fighting on a dirt floor, do not throw your mouthpiece out into the crowd unless you are 100% sure that you're never going to need it again. Uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.